<laughs> We're gonna need more barbarians. Does someone say hog rata? Yeah! No, barbarians. Hog rata? Barbarians. Oh, I thought you said hog rata. <laughs> This army, Clash of Clans. Hey guys, what's up? This is Nolan Slate, and I'm gonna be doing a Clash of Clans Let's Play. So, this is Clash of Clans, our beginning base, right after the tutorial. Um, as you can see, our town hall was level two. We have some things. Uh, I basically skipped the tutorial because. Hopefully you don't get confused um, during the tutorial. This um, explains a lot. So, anyways, this is right after that, where we have Town Hall 2, and we have some, not a lot, but not a lot of resources, but we have some. And we're ready to get started. So, I'm going to start... By training my troops, getting some barbarians, and I'm gonna finish the training. Now that we have some troops, um, I'm gonna explain to you shield. A shield is basically protects you from people attacking you. So you can see to the left it says multiplayer battles, find a match. You can search players that you can attack. But when you have a shield up, they can't attack you. Unfortunately, when you attack somebody, that ruins your shield. And beginning get an automatic three day shield, but I'm actually gonna get rid of it. Here we go. As you can see, shield is active, but I don't really care. Some stra <clears throat> attack strategy uh, tips, I guess. Um, uh, I like to go for the weapons. That way, um, it leaves them, your opponent defenseless. And at this stage, that's really easy because they usually have, um, like one or three weapons or something. Um, maybe a second cannon or be an archer tower also, but usually they have, um, minimal, um, minimal defenses, no walls, stuff like that. So it's going to be pretty easy to beat people like this. Who are at the stage? Here we go. We got a perfect. That means we get 30 trophies, and we actually got some loot. And now our elixir storage is full, but not a gold storage. So now I'm gonna buy some stuff. So all the stuff we're gonna buy: another elixir collector. How about another gold mine? Mm, I don't see why I had to finish that, but oh well. And the defenses, I might think about no weight in that stuff. We see army, no weight in that also. So now that we have all of our um, all of our resources that we can get, other than the third builder, but that's gonna wait. Um, I think we're gonna start upgrading. So this gold mine, upgrade that to level two. I'm gonna finish it. Normally, I'm actually a person who saves gems, but in this kind of thing, let's play, you wanna keep things moving fast. Because I only get so much playing time. And I don't wanna be playing a Clash of Clans Let's Play for three years. That wouldn't be fun. I mean, it's a fun game, but. Anyways. So, now that. I'm gonna finish that. Now we're going to upgrade this stuff. We're actually not going to finish it. Because a different plan. We're going to do something else. We're going to train our troops again. And we're going to go for the goblins. Goblins. Look at the right. Single player. Um, 
I'm gonna go for Goblin Outpost. Let me see. Okay, yeah, we have full 20 Barbarians, and we're gonna go. So. You can see this one is two cannons. Um, not unlike the um, the real person we faced earlier, only had one, but this is the new goblin, so. Yeah. There we go. We got two stars, and about to get the third one. Come on, defeat that cannon, defeat that cannon, and yay, we win. Okay, actually, we won one star, but now we completely win. So now we have more resources again. Let me see what else I can buy. Actually, I have a better plan. Let's make a layout. What fun it is to make a layout, which isn't really that fun, but it can be. Um, okay, let's see. So, at, I want to explain something. At Town Hall 3, we can get something called the Layout Editor, which is really helpful for, I mean, editing your layout. But, also, you can, um, instead of just doing what I'm doing here, which is really not the easiest, um, you can actually remove things and place them back in when you, when you have a space for them. So, instead of moving everything to the side, where there's, uh, these things, um, obstacles. So there we go. <laughs> I got it. Um, let's see. So normally I wouldn't actually protect my builder's huts. Well, right now I don't even have any walls, so I'm not really protecting them. But anyway, um, normally once I get walls, you, you'll be able to see that I'll be protecting my builder's huts, which you might think is a little strange, but it will be the only the only thing I'll be able to to fit there. And that space is two builder huts, not any other types of buildings, really. I mean, we can eventually, but for now, really, the only two by two buildings are builder huts. Um, I'll put this stuff in here. Let me see, where can I put this? Actually, I'm going to finish this stuff. I'm gonna wait until they're one gem. Oh, now I can move this mushroom. Huh, strange, you can't even finish those. Well, I'm not, I'm not going because it's 10 seconds, but. Okay, now we're gonna get this stuff here. It's a weird strategy. But let's see if it works. Well, hopefully, this should work once I get walls. I don't want to sound like it might work, but I'm not sure if it'll work. That's not. It's not good. When your let's player is saying stuff like that, you know they're really not that good at the game. <laughs> actually, that reminds me. I want to say I'm actually not that great at the game. I mean, I'm I'm okay, but I've only been playing for like two months, probably even less. And I got in the game really fast. I have another village, not just this one. Um, that's a town hall six. But I mean, I'm not. I'm not like amazing or anything. So, what should I do now? To be honest, I think I should be finishing up soon. But before I do that, I'm probably going to upgrade these storages. Because I'm not going to be upgrading anything when I'm gone. Those will take half an hour. So, this has been the first episode of my Let's Play um, of Clash of Clans. I'm known slate. Um, if you like the Let's Play, that's great. And uh, I'll see you later.